This holiday season, share your cookies with Santa Claus's elves and Skippy the train deer aboard the magical Christmas train. Here to fill us in on what you can expect aboard the train is Shell Hart. Welcome to the show, Shell. Thank you. Well, we talk about a magical ride on the Christmas train. What can people expect? You know what? This year we made it a musical and it's gonna be amazing. I think even Santa himself might come down and sing a couple bars. It's gonna be, it's gonna be pretty fantastic. Yeah, when you get on the train, you have cookies and hot cocoa and uh, gosh, um, all kinds of um, fun excitement going on. Lots of entertainment. Yeah, it's, it's kind of neat. Um, we've made our Christmas train more interactive, so uh, you're part of the show actually. Yeah. Well, what makes it magical? What makes it magical? Oh my goodness, there's so much. Um, I, I feel what makes it magical is that sometimes, every once in a while, the story comes alive. We base it on this um, specific story and the, actually things come alive on the train. Come alive. So I'm sure on this magical Christmas train, it's a big hit with the kids. Oh yeah. They must uh, love it. Oh yes, absolutely. And there's actually a story that goes along with this excursion with this ride. So tell me about yeah, the story. Yeah, it's called Skippy the Train Deer. I actually wrote it myself. Um, so uh, it's about a little boy who sadly doesn't believe in Christmas anymore, doesn't believe in Santa Claus or elves or reindeer. And so he comes on the train and oh my goodness, all kinds of things happen that help him to absolutely without a shadow of a doubt believe in Santa. And the kids who come on our train are the same way. Yeah, and that's so you don't believe becomes... before, you'll believe afterwards. <laughs> I'll tell you and that. And the story becomes part of the performance. So yeah. It's not, it's not just a train ride. There's there's a whole performance and show and, oh, and the yeah. cookies and, and you, it's comfortable. It's like you sit down. Oh, and yeah. Well, you know, a little known fact is that Santa himself sends down elves who are actually actors in the local theaters around town, around okay. Sacramento. Uh -huh. And he sends them down and he has them checking on people and they actually come on the train as themselves in elf costume. Oh my know, goodness. And, so and tell in me, their elf clothes. Yeah. <laughs> tell me about this train. Where can I catch a ride? Where can someone hop on? What, how do they make this happen? The wonderful thing is we're right in West Sacramento, uh, 400 North Harbor Boulevard in West Sacramento. So it's right next to the river, mm -hmm. hence the name of the river train, Sacramento River Train. And uh, they'll take it from out of there. Yeah. And so it starts this weekend. Yes, it does. Very excited. How many chances will people have to get a ticket to get a ride? You know what? Um, you, if you go on our website, uh, www.santa, uh, wait, actually, christmastrain.com will get you to everything <laughs> you need. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay, christmastrain.com. And you also have other experiences that you can do on the river train if you don't want the magical Christmas ride. But right now, as the season kicks off, that's, that's Right, what you're that's doing. the main thing from uh, all the way from this weekend, of course, to December 23rd. So we'll a lot have of the, fun. the Christmas train. What ages are best for this ride? Oh, okay, you know, all ages. I mean, we have, we have groups of uh, adults come on our train. Okay. Um, it's really amazing. We've had years where whole families will come and they'll call us in advance and have our elves actually hand out their presents. Oh, that sounds so special. Yeah. So you can bring your family, you can go as a group. Yeah. The magical Christmas train is taking off this weekend from West Sacramento. Shell, thanks for being here. Thank you. This interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.